you know, talk makeup about is makeup. like this ethereal thing. Yes. It's an idea. It is so and a, it's an idea and a bit of color. It's a piece of poetry floating on somebody's face. MAC is such a spirit of the time itself. It's right. such a modern, I don't even see it as a makeup company. It's, it's a, a culture. It's a culture, exactly. The collaboration has been incredible. MAC gave us the opportunity to be artists. You really let us play. But Isabel's an amazing colorist. She's always been very experimental. She's not timid with how she uses color, but it but it she is has to reacting feel it. to art more than beauty. I was trying to do a Ruben on my face. I wanted to draw my face with the pencil line and drawing in the eyelash, feeling the eyelash. I want to have a collaboration with art when I'm doing makeup. And it's interesting that I met Ruben and I fell in love with his lines. I must have started with the hula. <laughs> <laughs> you started hula hooping since you came from Cuba. The first American thing It was the first thing, thing I wanted to do. It's, it does feel American because of the freedom it gives you. It does make you feel like you can be in a trance. I see you do it all the time. So it's a kind of like spiritual mental trip. So it's an interesting... It's a good mental exercise, it I'll is. tell you. In patience, waiting for him. <laughs> it goes around in circles. Well, I'm mapping. <laughs> There's something beautiful about makeup. There's, there's room for the unexplained, there's room for poetry, there's room for things that, you, that are not tangible. Um, it's very much about dreams, but it's very based on some, some sort of beautiful symmetry. It's the icing on the cake.